بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹ ان دا فرسٹ ویڈیو لیکچر آف ویک ففٹین وی ہیو آلریڈی ڈسکس دا سامسن رول فار دی ڈیفائنائٹ انٹیگریشن آف اے فنکشن سو دس سیکنڈ ویڈیو لیکچر آف ویک ففٹین از دا کنٹینیویشن آف مائی فرسٹ ویڈیو لیکچر آف ویک ففٹین سو we are going to uh, discuss the samson rule uh, for the uh, some numerical problems so for the parallax now we are going to uh, discuss some uh, problems by using samson rule for example use samson rule with four steps to estimate this integration from 0 to 1 of the function 1 over 1 plus x square with respect to x and given the answer to four decimal places and find the exit value of the integral and hence find an approximate an approximation for the pi to three significant figures so dear students you see over here uh, samson rule with four steps formula is given by h by 3 into y naught plus 4 y 1 plus 2 y 2 plus 4 y 3 plus y 4 i have already told you in the previous uh, first video lecture that the initial range point y naught and y 4 will not multiple of 4 either multiple of 2 in other uh, in the other points uh, Uh, odd position points like uh, y1 and y3 are multiple of 4 in even position point y2 y4 y6 is multiple of 2 now in this example uh, since we have to uh, solve this integration for the four steps so we have five range points uh, y0 y1 y2 y3 and y4 for the function y is equal to 1 over 1 plus x square so in these five range points so uh, uh, y not and y4 are not multiple of 4 either multiple of 2 and the other odd point odd position point y3 and y y1 and y3 are multiple of 4 and y2 is multiple of 2 so it is a good idea to write down the formula with the correct number of uh, ordinates always one more or one more than the number of steps so you see over here uh, this is the integration of the function by using the samson rule now since in this question in this problem we have to solve the integration for the four steps so n is equal to 4 now the step size b minus a divided by 4 so 1 minus 0 divided by 4 which is equal to 0.25 so the first value of the x is 0 Now putting x is equal to 0 in this function we obtain y is equal to 1 since y is equal to 1 over 1 plus x square and the value of x is 0 so the value of y is 1 now the value of x uh, adding the step size to this uh, initial point we obtain the second point uh, of x uh, 0.25 so putting 0.25 in the function we obtain the value of y 0.9418 now add this step size again to Um, this point 0.25 we obtain the new uh, x point 0.5 so putting 0.5 in the given uh, function we obtain y is equal to 0.8 now adding this step size to this 0.5 we obtain the value of x 0.75 now putting the x value 0.75 in the given function we obtain the value of y 0.64 now again add this step size to this point we obtain the value of x is 1 and this is the last value the last value of x this is actually x not x1 x2 x3 and x4 so putting the value of x4 is 1 in the given function we obtain the value of y is 0.5 so this is y not y1 y2 y3 and y4 so putting the value of y not y1 y2 y3 and y4 in this formula and this is actually the value of h 0.325 divided by 3 so so using one word the samson one word third rule we obtain the um, result of this definite integration is equal to 0.7854 to correct to four decimal places 
Now, dear students, the exit integration of the function integration. So, uh, the exit integration of the function. So, to find the exit value of the integral. So, to find the exit value of the integral and hence to find an approximation for pi to 3 significant figure you see over here the integration of 1 over 1 plus x square with respect to x is equal to tangent inverse of x and now the upper limit is 1 and the lower limit is 0 so putting the upper limit tangent inverse uh, of 1 minus tangent inverse of 0 tangent inverse of 1 is uh, equal to uh, pi by 4 and tan inverse of 0 is equal to 0 so the exit value is 0 pi, no, pi by 4 the exit value of the integration is pi by 4 now the answer to the part a and part b are approximately equal so dear student you see over here this is the approximate answer of the definite integral by using the Samson rule 0 0.7854 and the exit value of the uh, definite integral is pi by 4 and pi by 4 uh, is actually uh, up to four um, significant figures 0 0.7854 so the approximate result and the exit result are equal in this case the answer to part a and part b are approximately equal now another example uh, to estimate the integral from 1 to 3 of the function 1 over x with respect to x using Samson rule with four steps and given your answer to four decimal places and find the exit value of the integral and give this correct and give this correct to four decimal places calculate to one significant figure the approximate the percentage error in part a so in this uh, uh, problem uh, we have to integrate the function by using Samson rule and to estimate the integral uh, to four decimal places and in the part B to find the exit value and then compare the approximate result and the exit result to calculate the error and percentage error to one significant figures. Now for part A to estimate the fun integral of the function 1 over x with respect to x. So first of all find the value of h since in this problem we are going to solve this integral by using Samson rule for four steps. So n is equal to 4. Now h is equal to b minus a divided by 4. The value of b is 3 and the value of a is 1 and n is equal to 4. So 2 by 4 means 0 0.5. Now putting the value of x uh, 1 in the given function y is equal to 1 over x, we obtain the value of y is 1. And now add this step size 0 0.5 with this 1 we obtain the next value of x uh, is 1.5 now putting 1.5 in the given function 1 over x we obtain the value of y 0 0.66667 now adding this step size to this value of x we obtain the new value of x which is 2 now putting the value of x 2 1 over 2 the value of y is 0 0.5 now again adding this step size to this value of x we obtain the new value of x uh, which is 2.5 now putting 2.5 in the given function we obtain y is equal to 0 0.4 now adding this 0 0.5 with the 2.5 we obtain the new value of x which is the last limit value of x 3 so putting x is equal to 3 in the given function y is equal to 1 over x we obtain the value of y 0 0.3333 now putting all these uh, values of y naught y1 y2 y3 and y4 in this uh, Samson rule formula for the four steps we obtain the integration of the function 1 over x with respect to x from 1 to 3 which is equal to 1.1000 correct to four decimal places now the exit value of the function to find the exit value of the integral and give this uh, correct to four decimal places and we ask to calculate the percentage error to one significant figures so first of all calculate the exit result the exit integration of the function 1 over x uh, uh, is equal to nature log of x and now the upper limit is 3 and the lower limit is 1 so putting the upper limit upper limit in the function minus lower limit in the function so log 3 log 3 
this is equal to log 3 and log 1 is equal to 0 log 1 is equal to 0 the integration of the function 1 over x with respect to x is a log x now putting upper limit log 3 minus lower limit log 1 and log 1 is equal to 0 and now the log 3 value is 1.0986 correct to 4 decimal places now uh, dear students uh, the person uh, the errors will be uh, exit answer minus approximate answer uh, uh, we can say that approximate answer minus exit answer uh, so the percentage error will be exit answer exit result minus uh, approximate result uh, 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 simple we can say that uh, uh, approximate result minus exit result divided by exit result multiplied by 100 so the percentage error uh, I want to tell you again uh, approximate result minus exit result by this uh, subtraction exit result minus approximate result we will obtain the error and the percentage uh, error uh, approximate result minus exit result divided by exit result multiplied by 100 we obtain the error 0.1 percent which is one significant figures now another example uh, to calculate to approximate the integral of the function sin x uh, from 0 to pi with respect to x using Samson rule for n is equal to 4 so for n is equal to 4 the step size b minus a divided by n b is equal to pi pi and a is uh, 0 so pi divided by 4 is the step size now dear students the exit result uh, of the function sin from 0 to pi uh, the integration of sin is minus cos x and now the upper limit is pi and the lower limit is 0 so putting the limit we obtain the exit answer is a 2 now by using the uh, Samson rule putting the value of uh, x the first value of x is a 0 and now adding the step size to the uh, previous value of uh, x you will obtain the next new value of x and uh, construct a table like you see over here in this um, problem uh, from 0 to pi you will obtain the value of y from y naught to y4 and then putting the value of y naught y1 y2 y3 and y4 and the Samson will be the third formula for the four steps you see over here this is the formula of the integration for, uh, by using Samson rule for the four steps so the first value of x uh, is uh, 0 so putting x is equal to 0 in the given function y is equal to sin x and now uh, adding the step size uh, with this 0 we obtain the new value of x is pi by 4 so putting pi by 4 in the given function and now uh, adding this step size uh, to this value of x uh, we obtain the new value of x is 2 pi by 4 and similarly adding the step size to, to, to 2 pi by 4 we obtain the new value of x is 3 pi by 4 similarly adding this step size uh, h of pi by 4 to this uh, x value 3 by pi by 4 we obtain the new value of x is pi which is the last value of final limit of the uh, x final limit value of the x so calculating this value at uh, this value this value and this value and sine pi uh, by using a scientific calculator or simple manually we can uh, calculate sine 0 sine pi by 4 sine 2 pi by 4 sine 3 pi by 4 or sine pi and after simulation you see over here the approximate result of this function by for the integration from 0 to pi by using Samson rule for n is equal to 4 2.0045 and now dear student you see over here this is the exit answer and this is the approximate answer so the error is a uh, exit answer minus up approximate answer or we can calculate the error uh, approximate answer minus exit answer no here you see over here the result is a uh, uh, the result for error is a uh, approximate uh, exit answer minus approximate answer is equal to minus 0 0.005 so the absolute error is a uh, 0 0.005 so uh, dear student you see over here the exit answer and the approximate uh, answer is um, most uh, close to each other so there is a very um, sh short error which is equal to 0 0.005 and it's depend on the number of steps 
and dear students if we increase the number of steps in that sample uh, samson rule then we uh, can obtain the most exit answer to the the most exit answer of the definite integration we will obtain an approximate result which most close to the exit answer if we increase the number of steps for the samson rule and dear students uh, in the trapezoidal rule you see uh, you uh, saw that uh, the errors in the uh, trapezoidal rule and the errors in the Samson rule for this problem uh, is very different the error is uh, greater uh, by using the Samson rule for this function as compared to the Samson rule for this integration so Samson rule is best as compared to the trapezoidal rule now another example uh, use force uh, four segment Samson one word third rule to approximate the distance scored by the rocket from t to 8 t is equal to 8 to t is equal to 30 is given by this uh, uh, x formula x is equal to integration from 8 to 30 uh, into of the function uh, 2000 nature log of uh, 14,000 14,000 uh, 1 lake 40,000 1 lake 40,000 divided by 1 lake 40,000 minus uh, 21 uh, 2100 T into minus 9.8 T with respect to T so dear students you see over here uh, that so dear students you see over here that uh, the distance covered by a rocket from t is equal to a to t is equal to 30 is given by x is equal to integration of the function from uh, a to 30 of the function 2000 nature log of 1 lake 40,000 divided by 1 lake uh, 40,000 minus 2100 into t uh, into minus 9.8 t with respect to t so use four segments Samson one word third rule to find the approximate value of uh, this uh, x and then find the true errors for this part a and find the absolute relative true errors for this part a now solution for part a solution for part a using n segment Samson one third rule we obtain h is equal to b minus a divided by n so 30 minus 8 divided by n four segments so h value is 5.5 now putting the value of t from 8 f of 8 in the given function you see over here this is a f of 8 and now f of t1 is equal to f of 8 plus step size which is equal to f of 13.5 now f of f2 f of f2 mean f of 13.5 plus step size which is equal to f of 19 and f of f, f of t3 is equal to f of 19 plus step size which is equal to f of 24.5 and now uh, f of t4 which is equal to uh, 30 24.5 8 step size 5.5 we obtain f of 30 so x is equal to b minus a divided by 3 and h by 3 into f of t naught plus 4 sigma i is equal to 1 i is equal to r from uh, i is equal to 1 n minus 1 of f of t i plus 2 sigma i is equal to 2 up to n minus 2 where i is even for f of t i plus f of t n so dear student this uh, sigma uh, mean that uh, um, odd position points odd position point is multiple of 4 and even position point is multiple of 2 and the first and last range point not multiple of 4 and neither not multiple of 2 so f of 8 plus 4 f of t1 plus 4 f of t and f of t3 plus 2 f of f2 plus uh, f of 30 and 30 minus 8 is equal to 22 divided by 12 so 
11 by 6 into f of 8 plus 4 if of 13.5 plus 4 if of 24.5 plus f of 19 plus f of 30 so f of 8 f of 8 mean 1.177.2667 uh, so so uh, dear students in this example this is actually uh, the function this is actually the function uh, f of x uh, simply we can say that this is the function f of t function is integrated integrated with respect to t so now this is the f of t so uh, putting the value of uh, t from 0 to 30 and this uh, function f of t you see over here uh, putting f of 8 f of 8 in this function you see over here the value of uh, f of 8 is uh, equal to 1.177.2667 and now putting t value 13.5 in the function we obtain 4 into 320.2469 plus 4 uh, into the putting the value of t 24.5 in the function 6 uh, 676.0501 plus 2 into f of 19 putting the value of t 19 in the given function 2 into 484.7455 plus uh, f of 30 putting the value of t 30 in the given function 901.6740 so after uh, simplifications we obtain the value of the function uh, is equal to uh, the value of the integration of the function with respect to t from 8 to 30 is equal to 11061.64 meter so this distance is covered by the rocket from t8 to t30 which is given by this function now to find to find uh, the true error to find the true error uh, dear students you see over here this is the uh, approximate result and this is the exit result for the function for this function taking the exit integration of the function with respect to t from 8 to 30 you will obtain the exit result for the function uh, 11 zero six one point three four and this is the approximate result eleven zero six one point six four uh, and now the true error is equal to minus zero point three zero meter so the absolute error is a uh, zero point three zero now the absolute relative error the absolute error relative error approximate result minus uh, exact result divided by approximate result multiplied by hundred uh, we obtain 0.0027 percent so this is the absolute relative percent error so dear student in this video lecture uh, we have discussed uh, some problem for paratex by using the uh, samson one over third rule and now this is the end of this segment thank you allah hafiz